Okay, I'm back. I left the camera grip out in the van, so I'm doing this, just propping the camera up. If you said, is that going to work? Probably not. Anyway, I'm just going to do this real quick before I feed them, because then that way they'll be hungry. Give a little bit of falling apart. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna order, I'm actually gonna go online and order more of these little shoes. So won't that teach them to te get shoes? No! Do they think that that's some form of food? Probably. Oh, it's going crazy. Uh oh. I just like saying that. He's unbelievable. this morning. It's easier, I think, if there's two of them, to do it with a tray. Anyway, I took the dogs out training. Uh-oh. And then I came back home and went back to the store and stocked up on Reese's peanut butter cups. <laughs> you said that's what you live on? Yeah. <laughs> lazy to go out to the truck to get it. I feel like that's all I do is just forget stuff and have to make extra trips. <laughs> you said if you could cut down on all that, you'd have more time? <laughs> Probably. When they're both doing it. No, she said, what about all three of them? That's even harder. Let's get looking in there, though. That's Fritz. Oh, my God. You are so good. Very 
very, very exciting work, I'll tell you. Will they hear that? They will. They heard it. If it's upside down, they can't pick it up. Uh-oh. Oh. oh my god. Crazy cute. Okay, I'm trying to do all three of one. wrong with this shoe. The shoelaces. <laughs> Little peanut. I found some other glasses though that I think I can use. So what about looking for this? They don't have any good Easter stuff. You said they forgot about Easter at Publix. That's what it looks like. That's what it looks like. If you think, said they think that that's a food bowl, that's what it looks like. Listen, you little peanuts. get over yourself there's harder things <laughs> it does it requires that you kind of it, the left hand has to know what the right hand is doing God, there's not seven of them. One time I did it with a litter of 12. I swear to God. I'll go find the videos. He said, I don't know. It was overwhelming, though. <laughs> he put it right in my hand. I hope he saw that. He put it right in my hand. She put it right in my hand. <laughs> That's Fritz. If you said, what happened? He put it right in my hand. <laughs> he said, does he think it's like a bowl? Kind of. It's 
spritz. It's gonna ride my hand. So cute. He said it's not a very good shot. Oh, hi, JC. Oh, hi, Jan. Is it too cute or what? You gotta get yours doing it. I got a new sonar video I'm gonna upload. It's hard. He said, get over yourself. <laughs> I know, right? Uh-oh. Oh, they're over there picking up the shoe. He's picking up the shoe. All right, so the way I did it earlier, I just did a little pile. She put it right in my hand. <laughs> I saw it, lady. Finish up real quick. And, oh. <laughs> you little kitty. That's Fritz. You little playful. <laughs> he said it was just a reflex. It was. It was a complete reflex. Just, there's this guy, Jan, I'm going to send you these videos just so you can see this guy. This guy's literally the worst trainer on the planet. I like to go on his videos to see just how bad this guy is. So it's ungodly bad. He, and he's a pathological, narcissistic liar. He said, what's his name? His name is Aaron Taylor. He tried to confront me last year with all his little pack of idiots. Claiming I don't know what I'm doing with the new collar. And he's been in business three years, and he's got me spotted as a pony. And he said he sicked his whole mob on you? Yeah. And he said, what did you do? After the thing, I went to his page, looked at his work, said, Mother of God, this guy's literally the worst trainer on the planet. Started putting all this garbage in slow-mo. And he said, what was it? Just bad training. Bad training was blatant abuse. He said, so then what? Typical narcissist claims he's the victim? Yeah. Then he went on his page and said, oh, she's stalking me. He said, who is this guy? Oh, some six foot four ex-cop. I'm stalking him. He said, because she took his garbage and put it in slow-mo? Yeah. He said, were you stalking him? Come on. He said, well, what was he doing? He was screaming at me, liar, liar, liar. He said, you, when you said you have little puppies picking up stuff, oh, he's seen little puppies before. He knows all about it. He said, you've ever seen him with a puppy? No, thank God. <laughs> liar, liar, liar. He said, what other lies did he tell? I said, I developed a, a way to do a trained retrieve with a pager. If he said, what did he say? I do a, train, a pager trained retrieve on every single dog. If he said, was that true? <laughs> I go to this guy's catalog. It's the most hot mess I've ever seen. He cannot keep his hands off him. I told him too. He's the handsiest person I've ever seen. Oh, oh, you threw him, you silly. Anyway, so there's this 
other guy, Anthony Bly. I hope he sees this. If he said he's terrible too, yeah. If he said who's he, oh, he's another six foot four, 200 something. If he said you tried to help this guy, you took your personal time to help him and did all these things, yeah. Then I see him sharing Jeff Gelman. That idiot was hitting the dogs with the towels. I don't know if you know about all that. And so if he said, what did you say? I said, this guy's a damned idiot. But I had said before that, listen, you've got to start making videos. If he said, what did he say? Well, there's one problem. I'm embarrassed to be on camera. You're embarrassed to be in front of a camera. <laughs> you need to find, oh, hey, you need to find other work. If he said, was he any good? Not any of the videos I saw. I'd be embarrassed to be in front of a camera, too, if I was that bad. Oh, my God, she put it right in my hand. Anyway, so I go on Facebook today, because now YouTube, or YouTube recommends this ridge side canine to me, because I'm always on there making these comments. If he says, can they see him? No, I'm sure they've muted me. Who could blame them? But I see this Anthony Bly on there saying, uh, trying to do ego strokes on this other guy. If he said, what did you say? I said, you are a suck up. Spineless. I don't, I, I don't have any tolerance for spineless. If you said, well, they're all a good old boy network, Kelly, and you better know your place, Kelly. <sighs> yeah, that's what they like to think. This guy literally has no idea what he's doing. I'll show you the videos. These dogs are screaming and running in terror. He said, can they get away? No, he's got like a 400-foot a boat line on him. But I said, Bly, you'd have to be an idiot to think this moron's any good. Hence, you're an idiot. <laughs> he said, that's what you said. Yes, I already knew he was an idiot from sharing Jeff Gelman. I guess I have a problem when I take my personal time to try to help people. I called him on the phone, I called him, you know, I don't know, on Messenger or whatever. Give him advice, do all these different things, try to help this guy. There is such a thing as people that just, uh, if he said, well, Kelly, he spent his whole life now. He was in the Army. Another ex-cop that's going to be a dog trainer. If he said, well, but they're sort of locked into this, the dog needs to be arrested sort of mentality. That's what it seems like. The dog is now under arrest. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh, I'm going to show you this guy's videos. I mean, they are just ungodly bad. And then just screaming at me, liar, liar, liar. If you said, do you make things up? You've seen my videos, girl. If you said, what about him? I said something about I put a trained retrieve on a husky. If you said, if you said, because that's not easy to do. It's really not. If you said, what did he say? Oh, we've trained 50 huskies in Malamutes. If you said, where are they? Nowhere to be found. Anyway, if this was like a year ago, but if you said, have you forgotten about it? No, I haven't. Because this guy is just that bad. It's blatant abuse. He claims he can train them. I said, I have an eight-week minimum. If you said, what did he say? He laughed like a little schoolgirl. He said they couldn't put full, they couldn't, they couldn't have an eight-week program. No. Oh, my God. He put it right in my hand. He's a good old boy network. He said, does that, no, I don't care, because I know what I'm seeing. It's just like anybody in any field. You know what you're seeing. I don't have any reason to make, oh, I'm jealous. If he said, then what were they saying? Then this one stupid woman, pack house. Oh, she's in love with Aaron. Yeah. I'm in love with them, so I start saying he's a terrible trainer. That's a good plan. If he said, this guy thinks he's some hot, yes, he's not attractive at all. He's got a very ugly on the inside. And he's not a good trainer. I had been friends with him, and then I unfriended him because he couldn't keep his hands off the dogs. If he said, what did you say? What did he say when you said that? Oh, tactile touching. So if he said dogs will do anything for this guy's touching, yeah, they'll run away. <laughs> Jan's like, where's all this coming from? Jan's like, who cares, lady? <laughs> This guy is that bad, though, screaming, liar, liar, liar. I don't know how to train puppies. Just all, if, if he said, the only person that would do that would be an actual liar. He's a liar. 
I've trained 50 Husky familiar. He hasn't even trained 50 dogs total. He hasn't trained any dogs. I don't know what he's doing. And then to claim I'm stalking. He said, what else did he do? Then he got his pack of little losers to go on my diamond bar kennel and all put one star reviews. If you said, you have friends with that low of a character. No, I don't. Well, the best thing I ever did, though, was remove the review section because you got all these entitled assholes now that that's what they do is go on there. That one bitch, Kimberly Goddard, you said you forgot about her either? No. Oh, she... She was told by this woman that I helped by sending dog food and everything else. Oh, go on her page and leave one star review. He said, you have to be pretty poor character. If I told you, Jan, to go on somebody's page and leave a one star review, I would expect you to say, I'm not gonna be friends with somebody that tells me to do something like that because I have integrity. So if you said not these people, no. Not even close. Not even close. They all went on there, put one star reviews. He said they're not supposed to poop on camera. <laughs> I know, but look how per perfect the poop is. Uh, he said, what's that? Oh, that's my Stephanie Lazarus interrogation I'm listening to. Anyway, but that's, that's what low character these people are. But for, and then this, if you said, then what did this podcast woman say? She said, oh, I'll take on her deaf dog. She said, what did you do? I stayed on this bitch. I said, bring it on, lady. Bring it on. If you said, did she? And then she showed you the whole world how you don't know how to train deaf dogs? No. No, she ran and hid. Never heard from her again. Oh, that was the one that was saying I was in love with this Aaron character. If you said, who is this? Okay, if Mike Lardy said she's in love with me, I'd say, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, this is what... If you said, what would you say? If Mike Lardy said that. <laughs> Oh my God, yes. Of course I've been in love with you, Mike Lardy. <laughs> <laughs> Who wouldn't be? <laughs> <laughs> Put it right in my hand. All right, guys, I gotta go walk dogs. I've actually got a new little training dog coming in, a little dislegato. I gotta tell Marguerite and Volker because they have one. He says it's very common. No, it's very rare breed. I've never trained one before. So it's very, very exciting. Here we go, I'm gonna upload that sonar video too. He said, we don't wanna hear about all about your little, it just bothers me when people are spineless. This is a craft. Your job is to challenge yourself to get better. The fact that people can't recognize, if you, I can't recognize art. If I went to an art museum, I wouldn't be able to recognize if you said go go into the art museum and point out the most expensive pieces of art in there. Oh my god, I'm sure. I wouldn't be able to do it. And it's the same thing with dog training. These people are not into it enough to even be able to recognize good work. So they went on there. Yeah, you should see these snarky chicks that he got to leave reviews on there like four of them all at one time, all from the same place. If you said, well, Kelly, they've had experience with you. No, they haven't. They're people of no character, no integrity, that, that are so stupid that they think Aaron Taylor knows how to train dogs. He's the biggest scam artist out there. If you said, well, what have you done? Made a lot of YouTube videos calling him the worst trainer ever? Oh, absolutely. I'm sure he wishes he never met me. But I tried to explain to him, I, he wanted to go live, go live, I'm gonna go live, 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 live. I tried to message him and say, Aaron, if you're gonna try to call someone out about the e-caller, I'm the wrong mofo to do that. No, live, live, live. He said it all backfired on him. Yeah. Couldn't be good then. If you said, well, he's taking your footage and said you don't know what um, you're doing. No, that doesn't happen. Anyway, all right, listen, I'm going to go, and I will be back. I'm going to go get my camera grip, but anyway. <laughs> it's like, what's all this? Anyway. Oh, thank you, JC. They are. They are cute, cute, cute. All right, I'll be back.